Good morning. This is Greg at the Pocatello National Weather Service office with the weather hazard briefing for Thursday, July 4th, Independence Day 2024. Uh, Generally, uh, we're going to have sunny and dry conditions uh, all the way into next week, and it's going to become very hot by the middle of next week. So again, we're not going to have too many impacts uh, going forward uh, through the forecast again today. Uh, Sunny with mainly light winds, so it should be a good day for fireworks. Uh, Temperatures generally in the 70s and 80s again today. By fireworks time, generally in the upper 50s to middle 60s across the region. It's going to become very hot next week. Low elevation highs will be approaching 100 degrees or even above in some areas by Wednesday and Thursday. And we are not expecting any precipitation through at least the early to middle portion of next week. Uh, Looking at the satellite loop, uh, I can see clear skies over all of Idaho and all of the west coast of the United States as an upper level ridge, uh, generally centered off the coast. And it will push east through the end of the week, weekend into early next week. Uh, Weather risk outlook, uh, not much at all. Uh, Possibly a bit of a breezy day on Saturday, mainly across the Snake Plains, Southern Hills, Lost River areas. A cold front moves through, so we may have some breezy conditions. That looks like the windiest day uh, through the next week on Saturday, but not really significant winds. High temperatures today, again, still pretty cool uh, for early July Generally, 70s mountains to low to mid-80s across the valley. Uh, Very dry humidities as low as 15 to 20% uh, in the afternoons. Starting to warm up a bit by Friday. Again, low elevation highs, generally mid to upper 80s, uh, even some of the mountain valleys. So, again, we're going to start to see a warming trend Uh, Still dry through the period by Saturday. A lot of the low elevations approaching 90. And as we get into next week, here's the middle of next week, what I was saying. You can see some hundreds towards Shoshone, Twin Falls, upper 90s across the interstate corridor. And even further west as you get into Boise Mountain Home, close to 110 degrees. So... We are going to see extremely hot conditions, uh, likely, as we get into next week. And a quick look at the 8 to 14 days, uh, 11th through the 17th of July. Again, very likely almost 100% chance of above normal temperatures across the whole state of Idaho. So we're going to get into an extended period of very hot conditions and generally dry or better chance of below normal precipitation as well which again, mid-July, we're not expecting much anyway. So again, not a whole lot going on. Uh, Again, sunny, mainly light winds today. Uh, Should be a pretty good evening for firework uh, productions across southeast Idaho. Uh, Becoming very hot next week, as I said. And then dry, we're not expecting any precipitation, except for six to eight days. So that will conclude the briefing. Everyone have a good fourth. Uh, If you have any questions, contact us at the number listed below 24 hours a day. Visit our website or social media on Facebook and Twitter. Thank you. Everyone have a good fourth.